What would you do with $96,371? Did you know that that's the average amount of debt that our Americans are in today? Between student loans, mortgages, and credit card debt, it can be very overwhelming. If you're ready to start taking that approach to paying down your debt, then you probably have heard of the avalanche and the snowball method. Both are great ways to pay off your debt and they each have their own advantages. So let me break it down so you can see which is the best fit for you. Let me start with the snowball method. In this strategy, you pay down your smallest debt first, then your second smallest, and keep working your way up until you reach your largest debt. The snowball method builds momentum over time and gives a greater sense of accomplishment. Whereas on the other hand, the avalanche method is a strategy where you pay off your debt with the largest interest rate first and build your way down from there. This approach is very helpful because you'll be able to save money in the long run since you're paying off the debts with the largest interest rate first. Both methods are really great ways to pay down debt and you can decide for yourself which one's better for you. Let us know down below which you choose.